My daughter's playing a Facebook game. Does she need medical attention? <laughs> oh, what's up, guys? So, um, I'm going to be showing you how to do World Edit and a nice mod I found along with World Edit. This World Edit is, if you guys don't know, it is a massive, um, what is it? A sculpting type of plugin. It helps you create massive objects, sculptures, buildings, and also helps you remove stupid things and bring things back to how they originally were before people touched it. I'm going to be using it on my spawn. So let's head to spawn. Okay, and I'm just going to butcher. Killed all those people. Now I'm going to put this on one of the sides of spawn. So, first you want to type in slash slash wand. Got your wand up. Now, the mod I'll be showing is this really nice mod that actually shows what you have selected. See that? Squares. So, first off, I'm just going to show you guys simple squares. So, I'll, I'm going to start off a little pillar. Or, no, not really a pillar, but a nice little spawn surface. So, I want I want a dead center. So, what I mean by a dead center is I want an exact middle block. Somewhere you could stand directly in the middle from all angles. So, I'm going to say expand. Slash, slash, expand. I'm going to say we're going five up. So, now we have this entire area selected. And I want to do slash, slash, mm, walls. And I'm going to do stone brick. This does is makes only walls of stone brick. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to edit this. So, I want to edit it so it's a nice little beginning pillar here. Yeah. Probably going to move that portal later on. I don't know. Actually, no. I'm going to edit it to how I want it to be with that portal. And later on. Okay, so do 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 Now if you guys are way too lazy, there is also something to make pyramids. I know, I know. Slash slash pyramid if I remember correctly. Yes. So pyramid double step. We're going out three blocks. Slash top sends you to the top of an item. Um, is that the size I want? Nope, I want four. That was done to undo. Slash slash undo, remember that? To undo anything you fucked up on. Hey, don't say you're perfect. No one is. I'm not. I have unusually sexy face problems. That's that's my problem. Pyramid double step four. Slash top. Ta da. Now it has done the entire thing by four. All right, so I'm gonna start adding some some of the new blocks that are really cool. Cause I haven't really gotten to use these often, the little courts and stuff. And I know 1.6 is coming out soon, but whatever. <coughs> yeah, sorry. All right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get to it soon. I'm just I just like to have very nice detailed spawns, a nice place to have it. And what I'm gonna be doing with my spawn is I'm gonna be showing you with this mod, you can actually make very nice ovals. So since there is a dead center, slash remember slash slash select will sell, as in select. We'll clear your selection so you have nothing selected. So in case you accidentally do something, nothing will happen. Now, with slash slash select, there's also things you can choose. So I'm going to type in a random letter. And these are the types of things you can do. Cuboids, which is what I have. Extend, which would push it out to the side, push it up. Polygons. Uh, basically, just polygon shapes. I can... I'll show you guys something so you guys know exactly what everything does. Polygon. Oh... I'll have a link in the description of this mod. I'll also show you how to download mods because some people don't know how to. I'm going to be making a star today. Now I really suck at stars. So we're going four blocks. One, two, three, four. I don't know how a star looks. Yeah, I'm actually sort of... Re 
retarded on that. Two, three. There. And then we're going to be going back up here to the out four. And now, uh, I have no idea how a star looks. <laughs> I'm going to just improvise a shape. And then we type in slash slash set gold. And that's my attempt at a star. Yay! But you understand the point. You you click for to start it, and you right click to set a new point every time. You can make squares, you can make jumbles of whatnot. Because this mod actually extremely helps you on what you are doing. Because sometimes you don't know you don't know anything of what you're doing. You just select a polygon and you're like, ah, I'm just gonna make this. Okay, <laughs> so now to what I was actually going to do was select um I'm making an ellipsoid. Ellipsoid is a circle for those people who don't know what an ellipsoid is. Just saying, some people don't know. Now, the helpful thing about this, this, um, about World Edit, is it will actually tell you how far you're going out. So, it's saying that right now I am 20 blocks out. Gotta make sure this thing is far within it. 20 blocks, yeah, that's reasonable. Now, since I have 20 blocks here, you can just literally walk over until the number on the very left is 20 as well. I have no idea where it is. I think it was this one. Yes, it was. It was this one right here. And so now we have a circle. And I'm going to make big oval. I'm going to make it go up. I think I kind of did this in the wrong process, but... We'll do whatever. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know, I'm just making something. Good enough? No. I'm gonna make it actually pretty pretty darn big. <laughs> like that, I like this. I like this. Now since I kinda screwed up I think. I don't know. I'll just show you guys what it does later on. I'll fix it. But what you would do is you would type in slash slash set. And then whatever you choose. Like, I was making it glass. And it would make this giant crater. See, now I kind of messed up on the steps. You're supposed to make the glass dome first. And then you would go under once. And you would do this. You would type in slash slash inset. One. What it does is it brings everything one block in. And then we type in slash slash cut, and ta-da, there's, there is a legit wall all around. But when you break once, you are in a dome. Slash slash select, you are in a large dome-ish figure. And so that's how you use ellipsoids and world edit in the mod and whatnot. Okay, let me just, uh, the last feature, which one was it? Select this, there's spheres. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. It's basically like ellipsoid, but sphere is the more much much more simplified. You click once. If you bring it out, it'll instantly just start making a circle. All it does is just change the radius. Like I can make a really, really big circle. Really big. Like you have no idea. Like, this is going far beyond the underside of the map. This thing. All of this. That is a lot of red, but whatever. It's happening. I'm just going to remove that so we can get back to regular. There. Less lag, etc., etc. Okay, so, and then let's show the last feature that you probably gonna need slash slash select and then cylinder all right now we got this this one okay three by zero blocks simple enough right 
you can actually make a soda can. This is what I like about this one. I've actually made a soda, a cool soda can type thing. You click it up, it will just go up. It will not move any direction. If you even by accident click something above the hot, the thing, you may not lower it. It will stay like this unless you decide to do such as contract something you might also want to learn. Contract what it does is it will pull everything down one or down whatever. So one down and it'll pull everything one down. Or I can pull it back up. And you could also do contract one up and it will pull from the bottom and go up one. Like I just spam that. I'll just bring it up a lot. Okay. Now onwards to the brushes. This is something a bit different. This is, uh, it's not really what you'd be naturally used to using, honestly. I'm going to give myself a stick, because a stick, you have to use a um, non, non-block non item. And I'm, I think it's non-edible, too, to use the brush. So, what a brush is, is a brush is something of whatever you choose. Like, you could make it. X meaning extinguish, I'm pretty sure. Smoothing, what smoothing does is it makes everything look more natural, more realistic. Make everything a cylinder shape of the block and thickness. Butcher, kill wherever you're shooting. A sphere, circles, gravity, everything will fall. And clipboard is something you've copied and pasted. Something like that. So I'm going to just show you the sphere because it's pretty simple gold and I'm gonna make it too thick there I could just right click and it will just spam I'm gonna undo those undo three you can also when you're undoing add a number to it I'm gonna actually undo all that because I need to rebuild this later on but everything's back and uh, actually you can also do redo one of the cool things, redo something, in case you accidentally deleted a bit too far. Let's remove that. Okay, now I'm going to specify more on cuboid, because you're not, personally, I see you as not using, not using the rest as often. By the way, if you are also one of those people that likes to be precise, you could literally just give yourself a wooden axe. A wooden axe is automatically registered as a wand. Alright, so you got yourself your wooden axe and we'll just set it in cuboid mode, meaning squares. Alright, so example I got all dishes selected. Alright. Expand oh I just shot it to the floor. If you don't write anything it will shoot in the direction you're looking. Someone should be looking going up. Now you type in slash slash faces. What faces does is it adds a roof a floor and walls basically everything so faces gold I'm pretty sure it also hollow no it does not hollow the out the area you have to do that yourself or leave it as it is if you like it you can use this for making big buildings or square houses now undo that now another thing most people don't know is when you're doing faces or walls or slash set you can Oh, faces, walls, now it doesn't work. Uh, you could just put in combinations. Like gold, comma, glowstone, comma, diamond, uh, some other things. Emerald. And when you just hit enter, it will just shove in random. On a random time, it will just shove in whatever things you put in. Like right now, I just made it illuminating because glowstone all over. And that was my tutorial on how to use world edit. I'll show you how to use the mod. We'll download the mod later on. Um, good day to you, sir.